Hi everyone. So welcome to the channel, and we are starting with the new series. Okay, it's kind of a brain teasers puzzle series. Okay, now especially for CAT students, especially those who are starting for uh, CAT 2023. Okay, you know already know that there are three sections, right? Quant, LRDI, and BARC. Correct. Now LRDI is a very important topic, right? If you have seen the previous year papers, you can see the level of difficulty it has, right? So uh, in Almost every three slots, okay. Last year, when you talk about, so uh, in the first slot, all the questions are uh, based on logic as well as DI, right? So DI is also there, but based on logic, right? In the remaining two sections, uh, one question was hardly uh, for DI, right? Calculation based, but remaining three uh, sets were again LRTI, logic reasoning based DI, okay? So logic is something which is Actually, uh, build over a time period, right? It's not like that. Ki uh, uh, from today onwards or from tomorrow onwards, you will start uh, thinking logically all of a sudden, right? It's not possible, correct? So, what is the preparation strategy for LRDA? That is the most important thing, right? Now, this needs to be done as early as possible, correct? Because if you start today, right? So, gradually, when you build the logic skills. So by the time when CAT uh, comes, right? So you will be sufficient enough examples and uh, logical skills, right? That is required to crack the uh, set, right? Because time factor is the most important thing in current scenario. You will get uh, forty minutes, right, uh, for four sets. Now, if you pick the wrong set in the very starting point, right, that decides your future, right? Okay. So the point is. Uh, for LRDI, practice is the most important key, right? Unlike quant or VARC, right? VARC uh, in RC also we can say practice is the key, right? Quant it's okay because uh, uh, when you know the concept, right? If the concepts are clear, so somehow you will manage the question, right? It's not like that very new question will come, right? I mean, it will be there, but most of the questions can be done if you follow the concepts. But LRDI is completely different, right? LRDI, uh, you need to crack there and then, then only, right? So, if you can't crack that, the logic, then it will be definitely a problem. So, how to prepare for LRDI, that is the most important point, right? So, for that, you need to build your logical skills, as I said earlier. So, in this is the series we are starting uh, based on the same concept, right? So, we will do one puzzle every day, okay? So you'll get basically uh, till the time uh, cat will come, right? So you'll have enough uh, number of puzzles to think, right? And these are very good puzzles, right? So when we talk about logical building skills, there are various uh, books available in the market, and one of them is George J. Summers, Test Your Logic, right? Very important uh, book for at least cat, right? Other exams also, and the, this book has. Very good sets, right? Fifty different different puzzles, right? So what we will do? We will do one puzzle today, and every day we will be doing one puzzle. Okay, so that uh, gives you an idea about how logic can be improved over the time period. Correct? Okay. All right. Let's start then with the puzzle number one. This is my brief introduction. You can join the Telegram channel. Uh, link is given in the description also. For, I will be posting the puzzles well advanced in the group. Okay, so for example, I have posted this puzzle in uh, in the group already, right? And uh, one more puzzle which I will discuss in the next uh, class. Okay, so you uh, go to that, right? You start solving that, and then you can watch the video for that particular puzzle, right? So to so get the concept that how should we approach for that particular puzzle, right? Okay, got the idea. So join this ch channel. I will be posting this in the uh, channel also only. So this is the first puzzle we have, right? You can read it out. The topic is ham yesterday, pork today. Okay, so it is saying that when <coughs> Adrian Belford and Carter eat out. Okay, uh, names are definitely foreigners because. Of the author itself, right? Uh, they eat out each order either ham or pork. Okay. If A orders ham, 
B will order pork. This is a condition based puzzle, right? Okay. Either A or C orders ham, but not both. B and C do not both order pork. Who could have ordered ham yesterday, pork today? All right, purely conditions. So, how to go about this? Let us start solving. So, we can follow two approaches here. One is the shorter one, obviously going with the concepts, going with the statements only, right? Or one uh, bigger concept, uh, what you can say that uh, time consuming, uh, right, uh, options also. But let us start with the first one, okay, in which we can solve our time, we can save our time. So, we will talk it A, B, C, right? Names are confusing anyways. So, if A orders ham, B orders spoke. So, let us say, I will say this is A, this is B and this is C. So, first condition, mind on if, right? We will also talk about in the series, uh, the conditions based on if, only if, if and only if, right? There is a special class for that. Do watch for that, okay? So, condition is if A orders ham, B orders spoke. So, suppose A orders ham. So, based on this condition, I can definitely say that B will order pork. There is no condition on C as of now, right? So, we can make two choices that he can order ham or he can order pork. So, I mean, if A orders ham, we have only two conditions, right? Because this is the same, because if he orders ham, he will definitely order pork and C will have two choices. So, based on that, we have two choices, right? Now, check with the other conditions also. Either A or C orders ham, but not both. A or C may say, ek banda ham order karega, lekin dono nahi kar sakte. So, first condition, if you see, both dono ne ham order kiya hai, right? Both have order ham, ham sorry. So, this condition is ruled out. We have only left with first part, correct? Now, but we have one more condition that if A orders pork. Now, first condition does not affect this because first condition was that if A order ham, agar A ne ham order kiya to ye hoga, agar usne nahi kiya to ye condition null and void hoge waise bhi. Isko mujhe check karne ki zarurat hi nahi hai, correct. Second condition kya bolti hai? Either A or C order ham but not both. In mein se ek bande ne to ham order kiya hi hoga. Ab agar A ne pork order kiya hai, ham order nahi kiya, इसका मतलब definitely H को ham order करना पड़ेगा based on second condition, right? Either A or C order ham, but not both. Third condition, B and C do not both ordered pork. B और C दोनों pork order नहीं कर सकते, ये तो वैसे भी pork order नहीं कर रहा है, right? तो इस केस में ये pork भी order कर सकता है और ham भी order कर सकता है, but based on this condition, this rule, this is also ruled out. अगर B और C दोनों pork order नहीं कर सकते और यहाँ पर दोनों ने pork order किया हुआ है, so ये case भी out हो गया. Now in these two cases, my all the conditions are being satisfied. Check it again. If A orders ham, B orders pork. A ने ham order किया ही नहीं, तो condition वैसे out हो गई. A और C में से एक person ham order करेगा, not both. So, that is also there, right? Or B or C, dono poke order nahi kar sakte, wo bhi in dono mein nahi hua hai. So, in dono conditions mein, humari conditions satisfy kar rahi hai, right? So, dono cases mein. So, A ne definitely poke order kiya hai, C ne definitely ham order kiya hai. Question is, who could have ordered ham yesterday and poke today? So, he must be someone, he has a choice, who has a choice, right? अब A के पास choice नहीं है, वो दो, वो रोज ही pork order करेगा, C के पास choice नहीं है, वो रोज ही ham order करेगा, right? Whenever they eat out, based on the conditions. So किसके पास choice है? B pork भी order कर सकता है और ham भी order कर सकता है, उसके पे कोई condition ही नहीं है, right? So this is something, right? कौन ऐसा है जो कल ham और आज pork order कर सकता है? Which is definitely B. Well, it is possible, right? That उसने कल ham order किया और आज pork order किया. तो B के लिए possibility है, right? Who could have? That is why asking. किसने पक्का किया ये तो guarantee नहीं है, 
बिकॉज हो सकता है वो रोज ही पोक पोक खाता रहे या रोज ही हम खाता रहे उसमें प्रॉब्लम तो है नहीं दैट इज वाई इज आस्किंग हु कुड हैव दिस राइट तो ए डेफिनेटली नहीं कर सकता सी डेफिनेटली कर सकता कौन कर सकता है बी सो योर आंसर इज बी आई होप इट इज क्लियर ओके और राइट सो दिस इज अबाउट द फर्स्ट पजल वी हैव डन वन पजल टूडे राइट इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो वी विल टॉक अबाउट अनदर पजल द सेकेंड वन विच आई हैज पोस्टेड इन द टेलीग्राम ओनली ओके एंड आई हैव पोस्टेड इन द नाइनटी नाइन परसेंट टाइल क्लब टेलीग्राम चैनल ऑल्सो और राइट सो फॉर द नेक्स्ट पजल फर्स्ट सॉल्व ओके इफ यू हैव नॉट ज्वाइन द टेलीग्राम चैनल ज्वाइन दैट ओके आइदर ऑफ दैम एंड देन सॉल्व दैट पजल कम अगेन एंड वॉच द नेक्स्ट वीडियो इफ यू हैव नॉट डन सो फार ओके ऑल एट देन सी यू इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो थैंक यू वेरी मच बाय